hello welcome to how to solve this exponential equation 8 to the power x minus 2 to the power x is equal to 120 we can write this 8 to the power x as 2 to the power 3 whole to the power this power x minus 2 to the power x is equal to 120 now according to the property of exponents a to the power m whole to the power n is equal to a to the power n whole to the power m we can write this power x inside the brackets and this power 3 outside the brackets like this 2 to the power x whole to the power this power 3 outside the brackets 3 minus 2 to the power x is equal to 120 now here we have 2 to the power x and here we have 2 to the power x so we suppose that let 2 to the power x is equal to y we substitute in this equation y then this equation becomes y cube minus y is equal to 120 and we move this 120 to the left side y cube minus y minus 120 is equal to 0 next this 120 this 120 is equal to 24 times 5 and square of this 5 5 square is equal to 25 so we split this negative y as this negative y as minus 25y plus 24y we write this y cube first y cube and we split this negative y as negative 25y plus 24y minus this 120 120 is equal to 0 now from these two terms y cube minus 25y we can factor out y y times in bracket left y square minus 25 from these two terms plus 24y minus 120 we can factor out 24 plus 24 times in bracket left y minus 5 is equal to 0 now this 25 this 25 is same as 5 square so we can factorize this y square minus 25 according to the algebraic identity a square minus b square is equal to a plus b times a minus b y times according to this identity we can write this y square minus 25 as y plus 5 times y minus 5 plus 24 times y minus 5 is equal to 0 now you can see that y minus 5 is a common factor so we can factor out y minus 5 y minus 5 times in bracket left this y times y plus 5 and this plus 24 y times y plus 5 plus 24 is equal to 0 now from here either this expression y minus 5 is equal to 0 or this expression y times y plus 5 plus 24 is equal to 0 from here 
y is equal to 5 and from here y times y y square and y times plus 5 plus 5 y plus this 24 24 is equal to 0. Now, this equation is a quadratic equation. First, we find its discriminant and see that the discriminant is less than 0 or greater than 0. This equation a is equal to 1, b is equal to 5 and c is equal to 24. And discriminant d is equal to b square minus 4ac is equal to 5 square minus 4 times value of a 1 times value of c 24 that is equal to 5 square is 25 minus 4 times 1 4 and 4 times 24 96 and this is equal to 25 minus 96 is negative 70 1. This is the discriminant of this equation that is also called delta. You can see that the discriminant negative 71 is less than 0. So, no real solutions can be found from this equation. So, we accept only this value of y 5. So, the accepted value of y is 5. Now, recall that we have supposed, we have supposed that 2 to the power x is equal to y. We have supposed that 2 to the power x is equal to y. In this equation, we put the value of y 5. 2 to the power x is equal to the value of y is 5. Now, to find the value of x, we take log of both sides. Log of 2 to the power x is equal to log of 5. And according to log property, log of a to the power n is equal to n times log of a. This power x will come here. x times log of 2 is equal to log of 5 and we divide both sides by log of 2. Next, this log of 2 will be cancelled with this log of 2 and at the left side we have left x is equal to according to the log property log of a over log of b is equal to log of a to the base b. We can write this log of 5 over log of 2 as log base 2 of 5. This is the final answer this is the value of x. Now, to verify this value of x, we put this value in the original equation. The original equation is 8 to the power x minus 2 to the power x is equal to 120. In this equation, we put the value of x log base 2 of 5. 8 to the power the value of x is log base 2 of 5 minus 2 to the power the value of x is log base 2 of 5 is equal to 120. Now, according to log property a to the power log base b of c is equal to c to the power log base b of a. These values 5 and 8 will be exchanged. 5 will come in place of this 8 and 8 goes to this place 
in place of 5 5 to the power log base 2 of 8 minus 2 to the power log base 2 of 5 is equal to 120 in the next step we change this 8 this 8 is equal to 2 to the power 3 so we replace this 8 with this 2 to the power 3 5 to the power log base 2 and we replace this 8 with this 2 to the power 3 2 to the power 3 minus 2 to the power log base 2 of 5 is equal to 120 next according to the log property log base b of b to the power a is equal to a this log base 2 of 2 to the power 3 is equal to 3 so here we have left 5 to the power 3 minus according to the log property b to the power log base b of a is equal to a this 2 to the power log base 2 of 5 is equal to 5 is equal to 120 and 5 cubed is equal to 120 5 minus 5 is equal to 120 and 125 minus 5 is 120 is equal to 120 you can see that the left hand side is equal to the right hand side so it is proved that the value of x log base 2 of 5 is correct